Jokic is just on a different level in terms of passing the basketball, partner. Jokic with 29, Reeves inside, colliding. Uh-oh. Let's see this again. Boy, he had to machete his way through that lane, didn't he? And there are all kinds of Nuggets defenders are waiting for him. Reeves is rugged. Caldwell Pope picks up the foul. Barrett comes out to meet Holiday. He's a push. Oh! That's a flagrant. We're going to take a look at that. Someone's going to take a look at that. I mean, he didn't make a play in the ball at all. That could be two. It's definitely one. Yeah, that's he's no, gone. Yeah, she's she's gone. gone. I mean, no head. No head. So it might be one. But that ain't nothing. I know that. After the play, we do have a technical foul. Back to Barrett. Barrett takes. No. Oh, good job by Porzingis. Next. And draws a foul. Wait. Which way is that foul going? It's a foul on Hardenstein. I think they just teched up Porzingis. Yeah, let's see. Does he swing his elbow? Gets the rebound? Oh. I'm not sure. I want to see that. I want to see that again. Me too. Oh, that's a, tough, that's a tough shot, but, I mean, what do you, I mean, I don't understand what Porzingis did wrong on that. He wrapped up. Good for Coach Mosley. Jalen Green takes off, tried to flush it on Isaac. Some contact there, no whistle, and that is how the third quarter ends, and Isaac is going to be teed up for taunting the stare down on Green after the attempted dunk there. I mentioned going to break that on this dunk attempt and then the block by Isaac, he was teed up for the stare down. Yeah, you can't stand over and taunt a player. In all these spots with a bunch of stars, they moved. Otherwise, yes. they're not going to get the ball. They're not going to get a chance to shoot. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Shane Gilgis Alexander somehow. And then it's going to be a technical foul because the ball got thrown off the stanchion. Ooh, that was a nice move. Zach just looked at us and said, why did I do that? He knew he made a mistake. He got the, let the emotions get the best of him for that moment. Watch this move by Shea Gilders Alexander. Boy, this is tough. Look at that. I mean, I don't, you, they challenged well, and then Vooch just in that frustration, he's done that before. Hey, listen, that, that was good defense. This is better offense. Yep. I mean, this is one of the elite players in the game. And boy, that bounce tells you that he's living right, as you like to say. Doesn't have numbers. And he's going to the line. Brandon Ingram. Luke, Luke Kennard is bleeding. He's bleeding. Yeah, two free throws coming up, but you're right. Kennard took a shot. As Jaron Jackson Jr. is about to come back. By the way, Jaron Jackson Jr., they put up four. It's three fouls because they, they corrected that one. Right. That would have gave him right. his fourth foul. And Marcus Smart got a tech. Right. Blocked out, but he did get a technical foul. And he's just going to bat for his teammate. He's just going to bat for his teammate. They blew him out in the second half. But there's Marcus Smart. Yeah, anytime you clap like that. But it's, it's also Marcus Smart being the leader, right? When you're in a new team, new situation, you come in with a reputation. You know, your teammates need to know that you got their back, too. That the Jazz able to get it back. How about the high level of play Whoa. we're seeing from both teams right now? As Chris Dunn, we rarely see that, Katie, if ever. Somebody picking the pockets hey, of the Aaron Fox. Fox, foul. When the sale was on the floor, wave it off. But it'll be two free throws team on your calendar because that's when these two teams will face each other again. That's in Sacramento. 
Bounty veteran official Leon Wood in his 28th season having a talk with Fox. We got a technical foul here. I'm trying to figure out where is this on DR Fox? Fox? Yeah, it's a technical. Here it is, right here. I don't oh. see how that is not a foul. I mean, it's across his body. He's left-handed. I understand why De'Aaron Fox was willing to pay a little money to make a point yeah. to the officials. Yeah. Gordon working his way in, meets three Lakers, and still puts it up and through with a congested lane in front. He's got 12 points and a technical foul. Screaming at the official. Felt that he was fouled on that. That's a, he's saying that's twice that you missed a call. A facial muscle. <laughs> Listen, the refs, the refs are always right, right, Reggie? They're always correct in their calls. You didn't see you didn't Because she can Candace. relate. Candace can relate to what Eric no was support. saying. Killian Hayes with a clank. Thompson. right side of your screen and Isaiah Stewart that was from the first half PJ protected his rookie oh ooh, that could be a hostile act to me yeah Isaiah Stewart got some handsy right, this is the first half and Isaiah Stewart the man they call beef stew had a beef with Brandon Miller then yeah, I mean you're a big guy but this is the NBA not gonna intimidate anybody after reviewing the play Technical fouls have been assessed to Miller, Washington, Duran, and Stewart. They can guard multiple positions. Look at Stewart. Yep. You knew that was coming. Cooler heads prevailing. Everyone's going to just hopefully walk away from this. With an 11 point lead, PJ, who wasn't been happy all night long, was not thrilled the fact that. Stewart's coming in for a dunk, right? He looked, he saw, he knew it was going to be trouble. You yep. see him look right there at PJ. He's like, okay, here it goes. Yeah, you can see he's not, he's not even going to attempt a shot because he knows it's going to be hard contact coming his way. It's in Detroit. After reviewing the play, the personal foul that was called has been upgraded to a flagrant foul penalty two, which meets that criteria. That player will be ejected. Yep. EJ's done. All right, so the, that leads us to uh, our random trivia question of the night. This is the second time that P.J. Washington has been ejected from a game. If you can tell me who he got into a dust-up with before, they got him ejected. Well, Horford, I mean, five years... He started every game here in Boston, came off the bench in the opener against the Knicks, played 26 minutes, 8.7 rebounds. Technical foul, yeah. I believe. And of course, well. yeah, yeah. with the team. So he, of course, I guess he scored 10 of 16. It's clear, you know, that he should be starting. He's frustrated that he... he makes that move, he wants you to reach for the ball because that's when he has control of it. Not that time, as a coral rejects Williams. Coral thought he got fouled, yeah, eventually he did. picks it up. He Here, did. Come, here comes Struz, oh brother, and JV just got a technical. My goodness. The Cavs had the basketball, and rookie official Inte Wang just gave JV Bickerstaff a technical as the Cavs had the ball and were heading into the forecourt. JV can't believe it. Here's the play by Coro as Williams made the shot late in the shot clock in the last possession. Coral thought he got fouled there. Nothing was called. And then as the Cavs came back. Point lead. Williams inside. Deals with the corner. It's Joe. Up top. Struce pokes it ahead. Struce to the basket. A collision. Out of bounds it goes. No foul called. Oh Thunderball. Wow. Let's take a look at the replay. Did Dort push him is the question. Yep. 
And you can tell the way he reacted, he knew he pushed him. Perhaps a better angle here. 87, that's what Struess was hot about, that hand of the small of his back. Boy, I tell you, this has been an interesting game here. I mean, it, everybody's struggling now as far as getting the right call. Rockets advantage. Smith. Oh, my. Blocked by Wemby. Oh. Again by Wemby. Get it out of here. Push the ball. Johnson on the drive. And he's fouled. Oh. And Emery Doka picks up a technical. That was absolutely spectacular on the defensive end from Victor. Oh, back to back blocks. And Jabari Smith tried to challenge him. And he found out. And he tried to sneak it by him again. <laughs> Meet me at 11. Victor was at 12. He was at 12 feet. What with the right hand? Run for a while. When Curry goes to the bench, and they obviously hope Chris Paul changes that. For his career. Yeah, right. right. <laughs> no, really. See, you go back to his career. Even when Durant was there, yeah. when Steph Curry is off the floor, they're not as good as the basketball team. The other guy that's usually off the floor with them at times was Draymond Green. Yeah. That's where I think Chris Paul can make a difference because he'll be able to run the team. Now, Peyton just got a technical foul after that offensive foul was called on Sharich. So, Peyton and Steve Kerr are having an extended conversation. Javon Carter on Bagley, he took a really ill-advised jumper. Zach tells over to get out of the way. Drives to the hoop, he gets hammered. Do we get a foul call or not? They're going to call a technical foul on Zach Levine. He thought he should have been going to the free throw line for two. Instead, he's whistled for a technical foul. Looked Let's like a see. lot of contact on that, Stacey. Let's see what happened there. Here it is right here. Oh, he pushed him. Yeah, he got a push. So Zach can't believe the call. Falls out of bounds. Oh, Turnover, okay. Alex Caruso again. And Levine right at Bagley. He gets the bucket to go and a foul. A huge third quarter for oh, Zach wow. Levine. Oh, technical. Well, that was a quick tech. Marvin Bagley didn't say a whole lot. He's got to walk. Must have had the magic word going there. Oh, no, boy. She had great those, double team. She has some great ears. There's a steal right there. And again, Caruso comes in and makes something happen. A double team in the corner. And that's the perfect place to double team the basketball because. Do that, you were close to being an MVP. <laughs> what a good shot at all NBA, that's for sure. Jokic, the Greek freak. That's in their territory. Yep. And the foot was moved. And a travel. Ingram has about six turnovers. Had five the previous game. So he's in disarray. Again, the Knicks, four of 25 from three. Technical foul call on Jalen Brunson. Brunson had had enough. This is one that he's not happy about. And look here. Ingram, he steps on Ingram's foot. Now, that should be called. Same thing in Tatum and Boston. That's the that's the call that has been such a huge part of official ball right. Again, the Cavaliers without three starters. And Turner draws the foul. Indiana got it up quick. Mobley was there. Struess was there. And Mobley no, literally, Halliburton threw almost a length of the court pass to be able to be effective there. And free throws now. Sharon Allen all out. Allen and, and uh, Garland did not play last night in their 108-105 loss here to Oklahoma City. But Donovan Mitchell did play at 43. What is this one? It must be a technical foul, Quinn. Well, no, it is a technical foul. They gave it to Michael Smith. I mean, Michael Smith gave it to Struess as Struess was trying to explain to another official that he put his hand straight up. Michael Smith saw it from under the basket. So he's trying to scoop it back to MB and had it tipped. Barnes, Melton, Scotty, no, DeAnthony, Melton, great defense, and Barnes talking back to the crew chief. Maxi for three, another! Tyrese Maxi, 24 points. 
in six three-pointers and a technical foul on the new head coach of the Raptors who's furious that Barnes didn't get the call on the fast break. Furious of that five-point swing, the two points they missed. Indiana Pacers team to advance to the Eastern Conference Finals. Clarkson, nice little duck up and under, nearly got the tip in, but and now we've got some conversations going on between Drew Eubanks and John Collins and James Capers, the crew chief. And Drew is telling James Capers, go look at the go look at the tape. Little box out, and it's just that quick little retaliation yeah. coming from Drew Eubanks. But they'll think as soon as they walk out because they'll both just be equally oh going at one another. I mean, it is the two on Olenek is Will Hardy all the way down in front of the Suns bench, and he is barking and just begging for a technical foul that he eventually technical gets. Has Bay and Johnson who hangs, takes the contact, no call, they're going to let him play a little bit. Murray, one triple, and the fadeaway falls. Hey, oh, a game warning. Uh-oh. Bobby Porter. And Bobby got teed up. Yeah, a little too demonstrative in his request of Jalen Johnson to let the ball go. Setting up microphones or the expletives? Well, and Bobby wants to get, out, get in transition and... Jalen Johnson tries to slow down the Bucks by allowing the ball to kind of roll off his hands like it's an accident, but justifying that, sorting it out. Sharp will bring it in play. Jeremy Grant checked by P.J. Tucker to the baseline, leads in. That's slapped away by Embiid, who is upset. He turns and whacks the goal stanchion, and he's called for a technical foul. Well, this could work to the Blazers' advantage most definitely with 4-12 left here in the second period. You see Embiid come in and thrash Grant and then gives that stance a very strong ball. There's Levine. And it gets a pump and reach in foul against Indiana. Will be its third and a technical foul is called. Rick Carlisle wasn't pleased with it either. And Matherin picks it up. Both the personal and the tech. And there's Rick Carlisle displeased. A drive right here. Yeah, that demonstrative kind of. Just keep doing what you're doing. Make him foul you. This is the Bulls' biggest oh, at seven. It's a triple team on Levine, and they do get the timeout to the Bulls. Oh, and he and Nimhart kind of getting into it. Oh, no. So All right, let's, let's just seven. walk away. Walk away. Walk away. No need to fight. Walk away. We're yep. winning. We're winning. He's oh, come on, come on. Well, you you got to stay on the yeah, bench you stay too. On the floor. That, you might cost yourself a technical foul. Come on, get, get, come on. It is right here. Yeah, Levine and Nimhard kind of got into it. Heel tried to separate. Levine was still screaming at Nimhard. The big factor here is you have to be careful coming off the bench and leaving the bench area, you can get technical fouls. There can be suspensions involved with such Our things review, as well. We have a technical foul on Levine, followed by Chicago possession at midcourt. Milton, little runner, won't go. Gobert can't follow, and he's frustrated that there's a no call, and he's called for a technical. He looks right at Inte Wang, who's again in his first season as a full-time NBA official. Call for the technical foul. Look at the frustration here from Gobert. I mean, he totally got his arm grabbed by Sadiq Bay that time. You could see on the right two that time. Curry. That's an offensive yeah, foul. He, That's he, an offensive foul. Yeah, he moved to the side. That's an offensive foul. Contact. That is an yeah. offensive foul. And a tactical. Because that, that's yeah. not a he basketball his, move. He kicked his leg out. That is not a basketball they move let like that. Let it go. Put his leg right out. He tripped him. That's blatant. So the technical on Willie, and we don't blame him at all. 13 to 4 to start the quarter. And this is what they talked about. When, you, when you're making non-basketball moves. Looking for a whistle, and are they calling it this late? 
That's a half hour late. Man. 3.7 at the shot clock. I'm not doing this today, Joe. Right. I'm not doing this today, I'm Joe. Keep from getting a fine. Herb's got four fouls. I'm not doing down. this today. Another three. This time, Quinones. Man, he got a technical. Draymond's on the floor. Yeah. So, he was he was pumping up his young fella. He was too far on the floor. He's back to beef stew. He'll spin to the paint. We're going to call it an offensive foul. Yeah, Joe's done a nice job defensively on a couple of different pistols, and I think actually it wasn't Joe, that's what it was. It was against Doug. Yeah, Doug standing in there with a 6 foot 4, 220. Took that hit to the Number chest, eight, sold it. And Isaiah still down. Oh, the wipeout did it. The Dimash 